Yo, what's up, fight fans? AJ here. Y'all know what I do. Talk boxing, everything in boxing. And tonight in Inglewood, California, Bernard Hopkins, the legend, gets his ass beat and gets his ass technically knocked out by Joe Smith. And before anybody talks some shit, man, I'm a big Bernard Hopkins fan. His whole story, I'm, I'm, I'm just for everything Bernard Hopkins stood for, stands for, man. The guy's a hell of a fighter, my favorite fighter. But tonight, Bernard Hopkins in the ring against Joe Smith looked bad, man. He looked his age. The motherfucker's almost 52 years old, and that motherfucker looked every bit of 52 years old. I know he looks good on the outside, but inside those motherfucking ropes, Bernard Hopkins, man, he was looking his age. The motherfucker didn't want to get off. He was just trying to, you know, slip punches. And these young boys, these young boys like Sergey Kovalev did just a couple years ago, 2014. Joe Smith wasn't having it, man. The motherfucker was throwing big shots, and he knocks out Bernard Hopkins, technically knocks out Bernard Hopkins with a fucking left, right, left, right. Motherfucker sent the, sent the legend through the motherfucking ropes, man. And it's a shame that Bernard Hopkins went out like this. Joe Smith is a credible opponent. If I was Bernard Hopkins, I would have took a, a lighter fight. But Joe Smith, he definitely dominated the, the first half of the fucking fight. Harold Letterman gave Bernard Hopkins a round. Personally, I couldn't give Bernard Hopkins a round. And even in my fucking heart of hearts, I wanted to give Bernard Hopkins a round just because, you know, that's my guy. But those little rabbit shots he was throwing and, and connecting here and there weren't enough for me to give him the whole fucking round against Joe Smith in any one of those rounds. And Joe Smith, definitely a New York kid. He comes out of nowhere and he beats the legend since that nigga packing. Literally, man. Shout out to Bernard Hopkins, shout out to everything he stands for, his family and everybody. His daughter was ringside and all that shit, but it's just bad. Like, it's bad when you go out like that, man. With that being said, man, Bernard Hopkins gets knocked the fuck out for the first time in his career. And there's so much to talk about in boxing, man. I've been going for a little minute, doing my schoolwork, but finals are over. And, you know, I'm going to be back talking that shit. And it's kind of hard to talk that shit, man. I was going to talk some shit about the Gennady Golovkin, Daniel Jacobs fight that's you know set for march 18th but i can't even talk no shit right now because bernard hopkins man just got his ass beat and there's a somber night in brooklyn for aj knows boxing man but with that being said bernard hopkins loses against joe smith technically not the fuck out and it's all over from here man hopefully he doesn't come the fuck back hopefully he just hangs out with oscar and gets that golden boy check you know get them you know get these young fighters to go out there and get knocked the fuck out so you could get paid bernard and he's always gonna be a legend man one of my favorite fighters man but damn it's all over man but with that being said make sure you like the video if you like the video and um Subscribe to the channel, man, for the realest boxing talk out there. Y'all know I talk my shit. Shout out to the LDBC. Shout out to all the people that's doing their thing, man. Blood, all these guys, 78. Shout out to everybody, man. I fucks with everybody. So, you know, I'm going to holla at y'all. I'm going to be back talking some shit about this Gennady Golovkin Daniel Jacobs situation shortly. And I'm out. One. Hey guys, thanks for watching the video. But make sure you follow my boxing Instagram page at Undisputed Boxing and follow me personally on all my social networks Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter at Who Is Flea. Do that right now. Links will be in the description. And make sure you subscribe to the channel, AJ Knows Boxing, for the realest boxing talk on the internet and talk about everything from hip hop to bitches to life. I keep it real with y'all. And I'm out.